I'm reorganizing my bookshelf. My name is Imogen and today I'm going to be doing a YouTube video about me reorganizing my bookshelf. When I got my bookshelves um, in Fe January, February, I organized them in rainbow order. Um, the Billy, these ones over here, the Billies from Ikea. And I love rainbow order. It's so close to my heart, but I literally feel like I don't know where anything is. I know what the title of something is, but I can't figure out what the fucking spine looks like. And sometimes the spine is different from the cover. I'm going to reorganize it into genre. Um, and this is just going to be a vlog, basically. Um, so I'm experimenting with the vlog style. Let me know if you like the vlog. Um, yeah. So my room is an absolute tip. Um, and uh, I need to clean it a little bit. So I'm going to do that first and then I'll see you after that. Okay. It's the future where I've cleaned my room. Not heaps, but a little bit. Um, I'm going to organize a bookshelf now. I'm going to do it by genre. I think I said genre, but the top shelf is going to be my like favorite books. And then the one after that is going to be genre. I also have two little square book thingies, which I'll show you now. So I have these two square book thingies that I'm going to be also doing. So I'm keeping my special edition um, Grisha verse here. And then these two, I'm pretty sure I'm just going to keep this the same because I really like this. But I'm going to change what I put here. I'm going to move Little Women and put it somewhere else because um, usually Little Women lives there. I'm going to move this stuff to the bookshelf because I want this stuff on the bookshelf. Um, not the Atlas 6. Fuck the Atlas 6. Sorry. If you want to find out my thoughts on the Atlas 6, go over to my TikTok because I talk about it all the time. So I'm going to be doing that. I also have my Harry Potter slash fan thing shelf and I want to move it because these don't stand up properly and it's a whole thing and these fall over all the time and it's just way more trouble than it's worth and I end up just leaving it looking like this not the best and so I want to I think I want to put my Harry Potter books either stacked um horizontally so that I have a little bit more room this way but they can still like stand up but I feel like maybe that's too much pressure on the shelf I don't know for sure otherwise I could move them over here and put my twilight books there but I feel like the Twilight books would have the same problem. So we're gonna think about it and get back to you.
because I don't want to fill up the shelf completely. Um, these are all the books right now that I want to keep and I want to display and everything like that. We've got fiction, general fiction, um, more general fiction here, and then it goes into a bit of historical fiction. Although I don't know why I've put Cemetery Boys between the historical fiction, but that's whatever. I've done it now. Um, lots some romance, some romance and some fiction romance, a little bit of romance down the end here. Um, and then it goes into fantasy, fantasy, fantasy. And then there's some nonfiction here. And I had put Zodiac there, even though it's nonfiction and it's in the middle of the fantasy because there was such a good hole there. I was like, I can't not. So yeah, and then I'm gonna fix the other shelves and then I'll show you what I'm doing, which ones I'm unholing and which ones are going on the other shelves. So my ring light just broke, <laughs> which is great. So yeah, I'm really happy with how that turned out. I much prefer this assorted way. I just feel like, I don't know, I just feel like all the books stand out more. Um, and I really like it. I've got some room for some new books, which is the best. And I've got room on the other shelf for some new books. Um, this is the pile of stuff I'm borrowing from people. <laughs> so I need to read all of these. And, and this is the finished product of the main shelves. I really like how they turned out. I'm really proud of them. So this is the finished one of these shelves. So I've got all my Twilight books, all my John Green books, and my Emily Henry books, or not all of them, because yeah, as I said, Beach Read is currently being lent out. And then I've got another one in the mail. So that's that shelf, and then I'll show you the other one. I didn't really want any of this back stuff on display, but I'm liking that I still have a bit of room. I moved all the nonfiction here, so you can see I don't read much nonfiction. Um, but I'll have to put some more. Um, I've lent out Cultish, which is nonfiction, and Happiest Man on Earth, which is nonfiction, um, to some people, so they'll have to be put in here when they come back. So that's good, it works. Um, my Penguin Classics there, Flea Bag, because it's a script, it doesn't really have a spot, so it goes there. This is a poetry book my, my friend Lexi was published in, so I've got that up here because it's nice and thin. But I think that looks good. Back here is Percy Jackson. Um, I think that looks good for now. And here is the finished Harry Potter shelf, updated Harry Potter shelf. I'm really glad with how this turned out. It looks so much better than before and nothing's falling over, so that's good. And I'm gonna now tell you the books that I'm unhauling. So, books that I'm unhauling, um, most of these I'm unhauling because I've had them for a while and I don't think I'll read them again. But the first two that I'm unhauling are Neon Gods and Electric Idol. I just, I'm not gonna read these again. I didn't really love them in the first read and yeah, I'm not gonna read them again. So, um, Red, White and Royal Blue. I actually bought this off Depop, so I'm gonna have to sell it for quite a little amount on Depop, um, which is fine. Cause like, I don't wanna profit make profit on when I worked for cheap, you know? Um, I'm not gonna read it again, so. <laughs> the Lucky List was really cute. I really liked it. Um, it's sapphic, it's it's a YA, but I'm just not gonna read it again. Shipped, same thing. This took ages to arrive from Booktopia, like four months ago, and I was really reluctant to get rid of it because it took so long to arrive, <laughs> but I'm not gonna read it again. And Payback's a Witch, I read in March or February. Um, it was fine, I'm not gonna read it again. Tom Offensive, it was pretty good, but I'm not gonna read it again. So yeah, uh, that's it. Okay, this is me still in the past before organizing my bookshelf, but it's just the outro. So if you liked this video, I'm so glad. <laughs> if you didn't like it, I'm sorry. I hope the bookshelves look good. Do they look good? Let me know. Imogen from the past needs to know. But yeah, it was so nice chatting to you and I'll 
I'll check you again soon and I'm holding you to it.